welcome to the Finger Lakes, <laughs> New York. We are in upstate New York. Uh, the Finger Lakes are, I think, five kind of long, long, thin lakes that run parallel to each other. Um, and we are right on Seneca Lake right now, which you can kind of see behind us. So on this rock bridge, you can actually fish here, which seems like a really cool spot to just, you know, hang out here, spend a few hours just catching fish, enjoying the views. Next, we headed over to downtown Watkins Glen. downtown area and it's really really cute it has such a charming vibe like I just I love it I could walk around here for like all day all right now we are at the Watkins Glen State Park and we have a waterfall in the background. Did you see it? Oh no, it's in there somewhere. <laughs> it's uh, beautiful here. Yeah, it's gorgeous. It's a, I think they call it a gorge. I think the sign was calling it a gorge. I think it was created by a river running kind of from higher to lower, potentially into this, the lake. I don't know. Probably should have read the signs. <laughs> <laughs> but now we're going to go into like what looks like a little cave and see what's in there. Yeah, there's some pretty intense hiking around in this thing. I guess by pretty intense, I mean slightly more intense than we were prepared for. Yeah. Uh, a couple miles, but they said it mentioned it meant, they mentioned it could be slippery and wet, which yeah. we don't really have the footwear for. That's so, my <laughs> so we are gonna walk a little ways until it seems like it might be getting uh, out of our depth for this footwear, and see what it's like. Okay, I think this is about as far as we go. <laughs> the ground is very muddy. It is, yeah. Uh, oh no, it's wet. <laughs> it is wet and muddy and slippery, and we're not equipped. <laughs> so I would definitely, if you do this, bring uh, shoes that are good for this kind of thing. So that was very cool. Absolutely gorgeous. It turns out that it was like the land used to be way up there where the tree line is and the river uh, freezing and thawing like chipped off pieces of rock and formed this giant gorge. So the ground is super slippery and muddy, like yes. kind of like puddles of water everywhere like ex Butter. and it's upstairs, you're going up like stone stairs. So for sure bring the best traction shoes you have and be prepared for them to get super muddy. <laughs>
so our next stop is gonna be the state park on the north side of the lake, which is supposed to have nice swimming and like a kids play area and stuff that we wanted to check out. So we drove all the way up here, about a 45 minute drive-ish from the south part to the north part of the lake. So we're now in Geneva, New York, uh, and we realized on the drive up here that we need some coffee. So, quick stop in Geneva for grounded. To feel grounded. Okay, coffee in hand. I think we're gonna walk around this uh, city town of Geneva a little bit, see what's going on here, <laughs> and, uh, and then we'll head down to the state park. Geneva definitely seems like a bigger town than. Um, yeah, definitely bigger. Than the last. Um, I already forgot the name. We'll put it on the screen. Walton. Glen. 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 But still very cute, very charming. Yeah. They Not have, too many people around, which is nice. Seems like they have like a lot of restaurants. I saw they had yoga and meditation. It's definitely like a hip area. I know, I love when they've got outdoor seating. Now we walk down to this little park uh, at the, the lake edge called uh, apparently Geneva Lakefront. The little lakefront park has little chairs for you to sit in and sunshades. This is so nice. I don't know if they're going to be on camera, but there's even fish down there. Oh, they left. But the lake is looking beautiful. Cute little walking path and a little beach where you can put your feet in the water. It's a dog. <laughs> oh, we're at the other side of the park we were just at and it's pretty nice yeah you can like rent pavilions here and people are swimming yeah uh, this is i think the seneca like waterfront park or it's also like a marina where you can launch your boat and I assume you can keep your boat there because there's a bunch of ducks. They do seem to have a bit of a bug problem here though. I don't know if this is yeah. all the time, but there's a lot of little gnats or whatever. Mm -hmm. It's not the terrible, but it's definitely worse than the other two parks we went to today. Um, and it's the start of summer, so that just might be how it is. But it's really pretty. Um, it's gorgeous. A lot of trees and yeah, just a nice walk. And pretty like, pretty calm. like relaxing like not overly crowded or anything like mm -hmm. that so I like that too mm -hmm. 